all gone. You can see some everything down here. He's, he, yeah, he's okay. There we go. Welcome back, party people. Today we're at Wilson Creek in the Pisgah National Forest and doing a little ritual fish dance, so you know what that means. Alright, so we just got out here. Got our campsite set up. And we're literally right here on the creek. This is Craig Creek and it branches off of Wilson Creek. I mean that's a pretty good campsite. Team Money's already got the fire started. We don't. Without a lighter. Without a lighter. Just put some leaves in there and some wood and it lit right up. Pops is back with us. I didn't even know there was a mountain bike trails down here. But uh there are. Show you what we're gonna try to go down here by the little spill well and see if we can catch fish. He said there Upper Creek is the best place to go, according to him. So Right here by the van, I just pulled this. Uh, this was a little bit bigger than the last one I got, but it came right up out of that little hole over there. As soon as I put the camera down, that's when I catch one. Uh -huh. Everybody's got the salad, avocado, chicken, cucumber, tomato, mushroom. They give him all that. Chick, 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 chick. What is it? Oh no, ew. Good morning, party people. We're uh, having some breakfast, and I put the camera in the water a little bit this morning. To see if there's any fish down there. So I saw some small trout and a crawfish. Last night I saw a brown water snake. It slipped right up on my near my leg there, about two feet away from me. Scared the ever loving crap out of me. shining the, the light in the water just to see what we could see. I guess it was attracted to that light and it came right up to me. We actually got our net out because the the, uh, Never use it. the bugs. The bugs are bad. So we got the fire started and then we've got my little screen in the door here. So last night I caught a little small fish. Today hopefully we can catch a bigger one. We got a lot deeper. I don't know if there's any more fish out here than the other place. We're gonna find out. We got some rock ledges up under there, up under here. Got some eddies over there on the rock. So we're gonna check it all out. But it's, it's, it's a gorgeous day out here, I can tell you that. We got our poles and we got our things. It's beautiful out here. Looks like there's a cloud rolling in too up there. I'm going to stick the other camera in the water real quick and just see if I can spy anything. If you look closely, you can see some small trout swimming there, but I suspect the wise fish and the big fish are long gone. There were swimmers there before we arrived. I'm going to try to throw across the creek and get to the far bank and see what's happening out there. For the science, we dropped a hook with no bait along with a weight and a cork you can see there. And those small fish were definitely curious. You can also see a larger fish kind of float into the frame here. So things were looking up. Don't waste your money on these uh, 1995 telescopic poles. As you may imagine, 
the rings twist on them all the time anyhow so you end up with a lot of knots in your reel you just because you're just not paying attention to it and uh, then they break so it's not worth the money Keep throwing out there. He's jumping for you. You didn't see that fish jump clean out of the water. That fish jumped clean out of the water. Yeah, buddy. Ah! On, the, on the spinner bait. I didn't bring my pliers. It's gonna be hard to get out. There we go. That's about what eight inches. Oh, what is that? Nah, you got to get some. You got to get some water through his gills, babe. He's, he, yeah, he's okay. Nah, he's too small. There we go. Look right, right under that rock where he went. Well, folks, every time I catch one, they're getting bigger. So maybe by the next one I catch, it'll be uh, three, four pounds. Who knows? Look. What? It took a whole thing. What? It took a whole thing. It's gone? Yeah. Uh, you're probably on a rock. Sausage. She lost the whole bait. Well, folks, we were running low on bait, and we decided to call it a day. We had been fishing with those little small red fish bites, but decided to try an actual bass spinner, which uh, worked out pretty good there in the end. Caught the biggest fish of the day. So uh, we'll wrap this one up. Until next time, skill up and ride, van up and go. Just remember, everybody needs a plan B. Ciao, ciao for now. Oh,